you're quitting the business yes mm-hmm. because now the the, bu- the business was left as a shell mm. so we are like okay we've made money kill them to end their own do, way do do their thing mm-hmm. uh, at the time i think charity was really passionate about the university mm-hmm. daystar yeah. and she was the one who was running a flail ah oh great it's, uh, big choir that happens yes. every year. Yes. That was her. Yeah. Uh, she's charity who? Nangila. Nangila. She's, ah, oh, she's great. this person who was the force of nature behind uh, Afleo. that. Afleo. Yeah. And yeah. she was the one who organizing everything and yeah. blah, blah, blah. Yeah. And John went off to work for Google. Mm. John uh, who? Wesonga. Oh, Wesonga. Yeah. Okay. He went to work for Google mm. um, in the States mm. where he still is. Mm. And I am easy. Mm. At that time when we were running multiple traces that's mm-hmm. how my career now is becoming firm to form it's it's beginning now to mm-hmm. singularize mm-hmm. So, sort of thing mm. because at that particular time we have, we've been doing this tech thing for a while it's not working out mm. then um, somewhere in the in 2005 mm. thereabouts Bitangin Demo and Mutaika we are appointed as PS and minister for ICT respectively which yeah. is the first minister for ICT ever in, ever mm. before there were ministers for telecommunications and so on and so forth yeah it was it was a, they were separated yes. telecommunications was like a Postal big thing and telecommunications yes. actually was <laughs> because young guys we used to write letters in longhand and take it to the post office yeah. and send it to someone wait a few days and then eventually yeah. it would arrive and then they send yeah. it back after a few days that's our communication poster was, done. was poster actually was something a, huge i think poster is actually something uh, it's going to be dead in the next 10 years I and mean, we should take our children now yeah it should probably it, it should, yeah it, 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 it will be a historical site yeah and it will probably turn into something different exactly. maybe into something else it should have already turned but yeah. that's a story a into a logistics story. farm or something I think, yeah, else. I, I really think it should be yeah. a logistics farm yeah. i think that poster should stop with yeah. the letters we, nobody yeah. is sending letters not even your bank is sending letters no no so i don't think that poster should continue trying to function yeah like that i think yeah. poster should become dhl exactly Right. exactly and i think that they should get a serious person to yeah. run it and yeah. run it as dhl and it will make money again and they should be useful to they the should yeah, yeah yeah um otherwise now it is mm. it really isn't yeah. anyway mm. so um at that point um that mutahi and bitangi have been brought in i have a friend called jay bala mm-hmm. um who's running a company called speechnet at the mm. time speechnet yes mm-hmm. which is also a tiny little Uh, company mm-hmm. um that's doing um this you know these voices that you get on 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 your phone mm. when you pick up the phone and mm. uh, thank you for calling so and so mm-hmm. yeah, those sort of things mm. um so he's doing that kind of technology mm. and I'm doing this but the one thing that we agree as small businesses mm. is that there's a problem mm. so we joined together with um Peter Kimashia who mm-hmm. was also another entrepreneur mm. and we start something called ICT village mm mm-hmm. an ICT village mm. um the goal was that we we try and get the community to agree the mm. ICT community mm. to agree on some kind of direction for mm-hmm. Kenya mm. we proposed this to Ndemo and uh, and the, and they like what we are saying mm-hmm. and so they we helped to write the policy ICT policy for Kenya mm. at that time mm. purely voluntary work mm. like mm. we all have our businesses we're mm. just putting and Jay and myself became the KYMs of this mm. movement that mm. was building up mm. it was us organizing this in my my events mm. getting the various community to give feedback the to then we go back and we are scribbling you are the pen holders and literally. then we, we take to demo mm. then they change it mm. to government mm. speak and mm. blah 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 anyway mm. eventually mm. the policy is complete mm. and the president launches it mm. and the policy has these steps it has mm. infrastructure mm-hmm. which is a, getting a fiber optic cable into kenya mm-hmm. it has access mm. which is figuring out how people are going to access the internet mm-hmm. when it finally gets in mm-hmm. it has content mm. which is developing a content strategy for kenya mm. it has e government mm. and finally it has data yeah so this policy creates something called the Kenya ICT board which Paul Kokubu comes to head mm-hmm. now at the time that uh, my business now is becomes viable uh, we have we've decided we have enough chums we are living mm. Paul ICT authority has now formed mm-hmm. so i have gone to the ICT um, authority to see Paul see how he's doing mm. 
and he and I find him and his two deputy CEOs at the time in the thick of trying to organize things because they came in running, mm. uh, trying to organize things. So they, they oh hi Al, could you help with this? And that's how I started working for the ICT authority. So I became employee number four for the ICT. I, I wasn't intending to, but now I've been told handle this, handle that. And we just started working. And then eventually I was interviewed and and I became Paul's PA. So this was what? What was I this? was just given work. Oh, it wasn't it was whatever they were working on at the time. Yeah. It's uh, like how somebody walks into this room. Yeah, right you're now. like, oh, there's something to do. do. There's some, Abu, uh, oh yeah. hi, you've come. Yeah. Hi, how are yeah. you? Uh, we he, need Abu, some hands. Uh, yeah, we need some hands to do this. On something, all right. So I just start yes. um working like that. Mm. I and was, eventually defined a role. Uh, no, eventually um, it was. I was very clear. Yeah. Um, I didn't want to be in management. Yeah. Um, and by the way, I didn't feel like I was qualified enough to be in management. Mm -hmm. um, but I wanted to be useful. Mm. So I decided that I want to be Paul's PA. Mm. Paul's PA is good because mm. nobody knows the person who stands behind the president. Mm. Yeah. Close enough mm. to the seat of power. Mm but invisible, mm. so they can actually be useful. Mm. Mm. And so I was, mm. and I had a great time at the ICT Authority. Mm. We, especially those early days, we were able to do things like Connected Kenya. Yeah. Um, we, were able to, we used to do a, an annual pil pilgrimage for all PSs, for several PSs, to go to the States. To the to States. To go and see Silicon Valley. When you, when you say pilgrimage, it, sound, it always sounds like Israel. Yeah, yeah, it's like every year they go to Silicon Valley. Yeah, which is uh, which is Israel for I mean, ICT. It, yeah? it is, it is. It so is. we go and see yeah. how what the what is the new tech and yeah, so on yeah. and so forth, and yeah. bring it here. Yeah, um, we got involved mm. in supporting the establishment of the IHA mm. and so on and so mm. forth. And so that's how I was in public service, mm. and I was in public service for for two years. Mm -hmm. It was fun, mm. um, and the big thing that I learned in public service mm -hmm. protocol. Protocol. Which is a thing that we don't have elsewhere. Discuss that a little. You see, in other spaces, mm -hmm. we we just work. Mm. There's a business, you have a business, mm. something needs to be done, mm. just get it done. Mm -hmm. These guys mm. have a videography business. Mm. There's no protocol to how videography is done at mm. TCG, uh, mm. at the, uh, your, your Excellency, Mr. Mkubwa. Mm. There was no pro But protocol, I came to learn, is process. Mm which is something that businesses could benefit from. Mm -hmm. Thinking about what is the process for us to buy something. So it's sort of like SOPs. It's SOPs. In a... Uh, it's in skill. You see in government, mm -hmm. everything is agreed upon. Mm. First, mm -hmm. a government official does not pick up this pillow if it is not written down that at a certain time, pick up a pillow and put it over here. So does that... Does that encourage or inhibit innovation? It may slow down innovation a bit, mm. but for government, because mm. of the fact that you're handling resources that are owned that by true. 50 million people, yeah, you can't be too resources. rushed. Yeah, you can't be too generous, be too hasty. Too hasty. Yes, That's the word. Yeah. You can't be too hasty. So yeah. you do have to, everything, ha with government, everything must be thought through from all angles. And therefore, there are some people then who are able to work in government. Yes. There are some personalities, hello, hello, who might find it very difficult to be... <laughs> to, I'm that one. Yeah. To be, so I, I spent two years in that place. Yeah. yeah find it like very difficult. It, yeah. It, 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 things would look like... And I think I only thrived the there time. because uh, Professor Bitang and Demo and Paul Kukubo were a different kind of government official mm. and they could see how to sort of navigate through the... Yeah. The... That. Rigmarole yeah. and the red tape. Yeah. Um, of things to get things done. Yeah. So the for as long as that stuff was getting seriously done, mm, I, mm. I could maintain mm, the pace. Mm, mm. And that time it was very, very high paced. And it's not so it's it's government. Yeah. Uh and that goes to also large organizations yes. and establishments. Yes. You know, um foundations, um parastatals, uh yes. just Huge, basically, Anything what is, is establishments? Big. Yes, you know, the UN is the same, exactly. Uh, they have a lot of red tape, exactly. And it's not bad, 
you it's know good. maybe it's the just, message here is not is yeah. that it is not bad to yes. have that. you there is a level of growth that you don't yes. attain if you don't have that level of yes but what has to happen is yeah. in those spaces mm. in sometimes they mm. should create pockets yeah of chaos exactly where a it's, lot of things can germinate and from. almost incentivize it exactly yeah. And, yeah. and even in some in, yes it's true in, yeah. incentivize it yeah that pocket of crazy yeah. is really important yeah because that pocket of crazy comes up with yeah. things yeah. that then can be structured sorry to again i mean to keep deviating on yeah. that google has this policy around 20 you know the 20% yes. policy on google yes. where they say 20% of your time actually spending on something that's not bringing results immediately exactly spending on whatever we, we, this is not almost build to your your, to your time to your time yes it is we don't expect the results for this to be anything project related right now yeah i can ask you what is it you are working on and you can say no no i'm just imagining what um, google gmail will yes. look like in 2025 exactly or in 2045 yes you know that doesn't have a bottom line right at the end right now yes and that can go quite against protocol yes you know because protocol could could be said for every that's single hour you're billing no that's it, not in our budget it's, it's not in our budget year. it's not in our time it's, yeah, not, it's in not in our, our plan uh, it's not in our arc plan yes. so things like those yes. i think uh, for establishments and mm. for huge organizations and for billable time exactly uh, can be very tricky anyway. and so now the goal was uh, yeah. for me i was part of the city board at that time when it was being set up it was fun it was right you know lots of things were happening mm -hmm. um and, and then a cool team yeah <laughs> and and uh, and it led me into the development space now mm -hmm. properly mm. um and because now i have money mm. um i can go into the development space now you have money because you're on 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 payroll no i have money because i sold a business oh you have money because you sold the business so oh, yes, 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 yes you don't get yeah. money from gaba uh, uh, that's from not payroll. why you go to work for government you go to work for government to serve yes that's true